Come along for the ride. This is the 80th Sturgis Rally 2020. Join us for the fun.
a state so cold and lonely I see the lights, I can hear the sirens Saw a ghost of a friend go by me I hope it wasn't him A silhouette of a man stepping off of his bike Walking up to me, me It's old Frenchy on his fat boy He said somebody lost their life They're coming from Texas and Tennessee Take the ride to Sturgis Some of them, they won't return Great ride into town on day one of the Sturgis Rally. Had breakfast at the Beaver Bar and now we are headed on to Main Street to check out the vendors and see all the people arriving in town. Right now it's not too busy but the streets are about to get full. So continue watching the video and let's check out the sights and sound of downtown Sturgis. Plenty of parking here on Main Street so far, but by the time we are ready to leave, the streets are full. We are going to take some time checking out vendors. Pat's going to get a tattoo. Um, so uh, check out this video here, uh, the next clip coming up. I am interviewed by a local TV station about my feelings on COVID and the mass of people joining in at Sturgis. They were kind of all hodgepodge back there. 
It's day one of the Sturgis Motorcycle Rally, and it's officially underway. Tens of thousands of bikers from across the nation are packing into the city to celebrate the 80th annual event despite the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. Keloland Cindy Thorson takes us to Sturgis to show us what this year's rally looks like so far. Bikes, bikes, and more bikes. Streets in Sturgis' downtown area are reserved for motorcycle parking, and spots are full. Joel Morris traveled here from Washington State. This will be his seventh year in a row. But we've been on and off ever since really about the 50th. So yeah, I can remember the 50th when I was here. So it's oh yeah, 30 years ago, yeah. Morris says he's happy to see the rally go on this year and that he is taking personal responsibility when it comes to health precautions. I'm glad. I, I think we need to see in America that, you know, that we're not to be fearful. I mean, cautious but not fearful, you know, of what's going on. So it's good to see all these people.
that's what Main Street looks like on the morning of day one. Not busy yet, but it will get busier as the rally continues. We are heading out of town now. We're going to head down to uh, Rapid City and to the rally at Exit 57, which is the Black Hills Harley-Davidson. So come along for the ride and our next video. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this one.